as moms, we make things happen. So you want to start digital marketing, but you're afraid you're going to be too big of a perfectionist and it's just going to suck way too much time out of your life to be successful. And then it's like, is it worth it? Because if I spend all this time and effort and I don't get to be successful, what did I even like gain in that? I, my kids were just mad and my house was messy. I just had no time, no energy, and I just spilled everything into it and I didn't make anything. So I totally get it why you are apprehensive to start as a busy mom. I am a mom of four babies. They're literally still babies. My oldest just turned seven and we are just in the trenches right now and I still made digital marketing work because I think that you need a good understanding of what type of busyness is digital marketing. Your busyness at the beginning, right after you purchase the course is way different than your busyness six months down the line or one year down the line. Right after you purchase the course, your busyness comes from like learning the course, setting up all of your systems, like your websites, your funnels, your stores, your email campaigns, all of those things. And then also just creating content. And that's the bulk of your busyness is creating content. You just have those three components so you can listen throw in your little ear pods and listen to the course as you're doing normal things folding laundry doing dishes driving and then as you get to the point where you are setting systems up I have resources to get that done very quickly within one to two weeks depending on which direction you choose but the part you have to pep talk yourself on to not be a perfectionist is your website creation and your content creation that is what will suck so much of your time out and make you feel like oh I don't have any time to do all these household tasks because I have to spend three or four hours creating content like when am I gonna do everything it's true if you spend three or four hours doing content you're not going to get anything else done and it's not going to be a very successful thing for you and your family but you can create content in a way that makes sense for you and your family if you let go of the perfectionist i know that is easier said than done believe me tell yourself it's okay to create content that's bad it's okay to create content that it doesn't say exactly what you want to say because honestly at the beginning no one's really listening to your content anyway which is like great and terrible right you want to just like become wildly successful at the beginning but then you're also nervous that people are going to see this content and think that you're not worthy of following i get it i was there i felt the same way and i was someone who drastically overspent time on content creation but if you can get in the mindset where you can do this and you can learn to create content and and learn to do things without being a perfectionist you will be more successful than you ever would have been if you held on to those perfectionist tendencies